there's mathematics, biology and robotics and they're all at the Lancashire Science Festival and getting a lot of children interested in engineering and how things work. But BMX biking, well, yeah, there's a lot of technology to learn here as well. So we're doing a show all about the science of extreme sports. So we've got uh, free runners, we've got trials riders, we've got freestyle mountain bikers, and we use it as a way in to talk about um, lots of physics, lots of physiology, so what's going on inside our bodies. Um, it's great, the crowd absolutely love it. And what do they learn and what do they come away with from it? For us, it's just about showing them that there's science in everything around. So, you know, I'm not necessarily, I don't mind if they don't learn anything, uh, but we tell them those are really interesting things. It puts some of, the, some of the principles that they learn in school into practice. So you can see that the harder you push off the floor, the harder you can, the higher you can jump up. Um, they look at people jumping in the air and doing backflips, and we learn about trajectories and that sort of stuff. But it's much more about just exciting them and infusing them and, and seeing how there's loads of science in extreme sports. And maybe if you're not an athlete, Robot Wars is coming back on TV, so perhaps you'd like to learn how to make one of those. We're basically getting the word out about our educational robot system, so we, the children can build robots and engineer them and enter into competitions. Um, and eventually, the competition's got so big in the UK that they go to Kentucky for the finals, but it encourages STEM within school, so um, more of an engineering side than anything else. So they can build the robots, uh, program the robots, and uh, manoeuvre them themselves as teams, so it encourages teamwork as well. When many of us were at school, all we had was a blackboard, but children are loving the technology in this show. They get excited about it, which is lovely. It's good seeing the excitement about it and asking questions and being interested about how they're built and how they work. It's just great. Of course, there's a serious side to Lancashire Science Festival as companies get involved and children get an idea of where their future may lie. We've got loads of different companies. We've got everything from local conglomerations such as the City Deal Partnership to uh, big organisations like BAE and National Nuclear Laboratories to professional bodies such as the Institute of Physics and the Institute of uh, Engineering Technology. And um, We also have loads of great stands run by our own UCLan staff as well. And one of the major lessons in biology is all about brushing your teeth. Um, we're here to educate children on um, how to brush their teeth properly and how much sugar they have in the foods and drinks, but not just the amount of sugar, um, the amount of acid as well that some drinks have, because some drinks might be low on sugar but might have a, have a high acid, um, acidity of them. The crowds are certainly flocking into Preston and who knows, the next Tim Peake or Brian Cox might be getting inspiration right here. Roland Gent... That's Lancashire.